hello friends welcome to my youtube channel sap b1 tutorial uh, today we will start a new training of sap business one add-on development using the sap b1 studio that will be integrated with the visual studio okay uh, in this video we are creating a simple project that can be connected with the SAP application uh, and the DIAP means the data interface of the SAP application. Okay, uh, so first of all, I will start my SAP application and log in into one company. okay uh, now we are going to create a one project from the visual studio so i will start my visual studio and create a new project in the visual studio in search template I'm going to search SAP. Uh, so the result will show us the SAP Business One Add-on project, and with the C Sharp and Visual Basic, uh, I'm going to uh, start a project with the C Sharp. Okay, so I'm selecting the uh, SAP Business One Add-on project and click on Next. Give the name of your application or a project name. Step G1. Okay, so create on a click on a create button. <coughs> As you say, uh, one form is there when a uh, project is created and some class file manu and a program uh, is there automatically created and given by this project template okay so uh, first of all i will show you in the project program uh, in program manu class is called and the manu items are added at the time of starting the application uh, in manu add manu method uh, system will give us the code of uh, adding a menu in SAP Business One. So this code is uh, by default given by the SAP V1 add-on project. And you, if you need to change the name of your application that shown here in SAP modules, you need to uh, just change the string of that uh, menu creation in menu creation code so i will give name as a paste application version one here you say uh, see this that uh, menu creation object already create uh, code is already done by, given by the sap okay so just we need to change if we need to change the un unique id we will change and the name of that application will be changed from here okay and if you need to uh, if you are if you want to chat uh, add a sub sub menu in this application you need to just define uh, the sub menu in that menu as the given sample code like this okay so in this code the uh, the form one that is given by the project is defined here as a menu open we are uh, clicking on the menu the menu event is occur and for the menu event uh, the system will give the uh, by default one uh, menu event in the menu class okay and as you see when menu event is occur we need to define that for which menu i do id we will going to do some work okay so you have see this menu id for the form one when we are clicking on the menu id form one 
okay then we need to open that form one okay so uh, see what you see that the sap when we create a project with the sap business one add-on project the system will give us the directly connected to the sap application without uh, adding any any method to connect with the sbo gui it will connect automatically from this code okay so uh, i am going to start this, this project to show you that the application this project is connected with the sap application or not before going to start i will show you the menu here you cannot see the menu of test application and now i am going to start this application now my application is connected and you see the menu of uh, the form menu and the form one sub menu in the modules okay when we are clicking on this form uh, our event is occur and the form one is open here okay this is the ui api, UI API of the sap application is connected now we want to connect the data interface of this application so for that we need to define some uh, we need to declare and define two objects first first one is the sap bo ui application and second one is sap bobs company okay so i am going to just declare this first i am defining this uh, this two object as a static so I can use these uh, two uh, objects in anywhere in this application. Okay, so public static SAP POUI dot application SBO underscore app equal to null public SAP POBS dot com dot company O company is working on Uh, after de uh, declaring this i am defining the application in this before going to adding a menu so my sbo application is equal to o app that all uh, that is already given by the sap at in by the project okay so i am going to just declare that sap boui dot application equal to o application okay and now connected with the company who company is equal to sap bobs company dot sbo application dot company dot get bi company okay now uh, we need to check that how uh, if our company is connected or not for checking that i am just showing the message that each company is connected and the company name of uh, the connected sap application by the message box so showing the message box we need to use the sbo application dot message box okay now we have to give the string that welcome to to company name okay so 
we define the company name we will use the o company object here, dot company name dot to string okay and the uh, other parameters for that message box are the optionals just for the default button uh, the caption of button second button and the third button if you want to give that okay i'm not giving that uh, another parameter i'm just passing the string and the message box okay now i'm going to run this project okay okay it will show the error message that framework is framework boui is not cast with the so uh, we cannot pass the uh, as in uh, declare the sap boui application to directly or application we need to define the application dot ESPO application it will be connected with the SAP application okay so one major difference is here that the references of DLL uh, in the in traditional way we are uh, the two references are the SAP business one uh, UI API and second SAP B1 BI API instead of that using two API uh, two references of DLL uh, when we are using the SAP Business One Network project, uh, only one reference is that that is SAP Business One SDK. Okay, uh, so I'm going to start the project now. And uh, my uh, project is start project is started and the message box is shows this welcome to this database and as per the coding that my company is connected okay uh, okay and see this because already menu has exist uh, already exist in the module system will showing the error message that modules are menus are already here okay so uh, up in this video we are uh, we are just checking that how to connect with the sap business